If you are a public school teacher or an aspiring public school teacher, this video is for you. Today's video, I will be sharing to you the complete list of benefits and allowances for public school teachers for fiscal year 2022. All information contained in this video is from the Department of Education's Bureau of Human Resource and Organizational Development. For more details, please watch the full video. By law, the biggest share of the national budget goes to the education sector, which covers funding for the Department of Education, Commission on Higher Education, Technical Education and Skills Development Authority, and state universities and colleges. For fiscal year 2022, DepEd, along with its attached agencies, received $633.32 billion or 80.32% of the total education sector's budget. Compensation and professional development for personnel. To acknowledge the efforts of its teaching and non-teaching personnel, the department has allocated $479.26 billion for their compensation and various benefits, allowances, incentives, and professional development. The table shows the compensation and professional development for personnel. For compensation and benefits, $345.51 billion is allocated for permanent positions, basic salary, total permanent positions, creation of new positions, and reclassification of positions. $28.19 billion is for mid-year bonus. $28.19 billion is for year-end bonus. $22.66 billion for personal economic relief allowance or PERA. $13.77 billion for lump sum for filling of positions. $9.34 billion for other benefits such as pag-ibig, PhilHealth, Employees' Compensation Insurance Premiums, Loyalty Award, and Terminal Leave. $5.67 billion for Clothing and Uniform Allowance. $4.85 billion for Non-Permanent Positions. $4.72 billion for PEI or Productivity Enhancement Incentive. $4.72 billion for Cash Gift. $4.44 billion for Cash Allowance for Teachers. $2.34 billion for Special Hardship Allowance, $925.18 million for World Teachers' Day Incentive Benefit, $845.70 million for Step Increment, $605.40 million for Magna Carta for Public Health Workers, $414.19 million for Honoraria for Teaching Overload, $73.28 million for representation allowance, $70.69 million for transportation allowance, a total of $477.33 billion for compensation and benefits. For professional development for personnel, $1.82 billion is allotted for human resource development for personnel in schools and learning centers, $107.43 million for organizational and professional development for non-school or learning centers. For other benefits and allowances for teachers and deputy personnel, 2000 per month for personal economic relief allowance, 1 month basic pay of the employee for the 13th month pay or mid-year bonus, 1 month basic pay of the employee for year-end bonus or the 14th month pay, 25% of monthly salary for a period of 10 months for every fiscal year for qualified personnel for special hardship allowance. Honoraria for teaching overload, a maximum of 25% of the annual basic salary. Cash allowance for teachers, a maximum of 5,000 per school year for eligible classroom teacher. Representation allowance and transportation allowance from 5 from 5,000 to 14,000 each personnel depending on positions or eligibility. Step increment due to length of service depending on the salary grade table. 
cash gift which is 5,000 and is subject to conditions set by the Department of Budget and Management issue once. 5,000 per year for Productivity Enhancement Incentive or PEI. 1,000 for every year of service of the qualified employee for Loyalty Cash Incentive. 3,200 per month for Transportation Allowance for us Teachers. 5,000 per year for teaching aid allowance for all teachers and one time three salary step increments depending on salary grade of the teachers four step increment for specializing in teaching science and or mathematics 1000 per teacher for Wor world teachers day incentive benefit bonus and a percentage of salary based on performance ranking if DepEd is eligible for PBB for the performance-based bonus. There you go, teachers. Those are the complete benefits and allowances for public school teachers for fiscal year 2022. If you like this video, please give it a massive thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for you to be updated on my future uploads. Stay safe!